something new with Argos. I wanted to use have him use his problem solving skills. We're gonna do back up. So here's a rug here, and I want Argos to have his back paws on this rug. I'm going to reward him for being uh, on that rug with just the back paws. The idea is that he learns to stay on that back so well that when I move a treat forward and he goes to get it, he remembers to go back and target that rug, essentially walking backwards or doing that back up. So here he is. I'm gonna get just the back paws on the rug. I love doing this with dogs because it's awesome problem solving skills. Well, both of those paws there. Dogs aren't aware of their back paws. So this is why sometimes it takes them a while to target them at good boy, treat on the floor. And when he looks up at me, treat on the floor. Good boy, we're doing excellent. This does take a few repetitions. I want him to learn that standing like this pays. Good boy. Looks up at me again. Good boy. So that when I take a step back, put that treat there and go for it, Argos, and see if he will back up to that rug. Almost. He went to a sit, so we need to do this a couple times. It does take a lot of practice for dogs to get this. A couple sessions. Treat there. Treat there. Okay. See if I put one forward. Slightly, Argos, and he goes into a sit. Let's try that again. So he may not be at the point where he's going to back up today, but we want to end on a good note. I want to reward him for being aware of those back pops. This way, stand. Good, treat there. And treat. And treat there. And treat. We'll end on a good note. We'll pick this session up next time. He's had a good start learning back pause there. Eventually he'll be able to do that. Again, it does take a couple sessions, but he's off to that start.